Hey everybody, what's going on? It's your girl Queen Kimmy from Kimmy underscore Queen of Crafts. And I'm here with the Crystal Canvas Art Designs unboxing. How's everybody today? I'm blessed, I'm highly favored, I won't complain. If you're new here, welcome, welcome. If you're returning, thank you for coming back to support me. I really appreciate it. So, guys, these are my very first Crystal Canvas Art Design purchases. Now, um, I actually got these a while back, and I, I did the filming of the video, but I'm having to refilm it. So, um, I have, I'm so sorry. I don't know why every time I do a video, I got to yawn. But when I'm sitting here not talking, doing nothing, I don't have to yawn. So my apologies, people. <laughs> so what I was going to say is I do have some other Crystal Canvas art designs. I got them from a D-Stash. Um, and if I haven't already, I'll upload those videos as well. But yes, so the two that I got is Dreaming Unicorn and Glam Girl. And so... This one actually has a story behind it, but I'll get to it once we unbox it. I want to unbox the Dreaming Unicorn first. It is a 30 by 30. And what do we do first? Um, the toolkit. Why do we do that? Because there's an unwritten rule in the Diamond Painting Handbook 101 on the very last page, down at the bottom with an asterisk that I added that says you must first show the toolkit. So this one that's the toolkit. <laughs> so I'm just being funny, you guys. So it comes with everything that you need to work on your canvas. Um, it comes with a pen. Um, I believe this one had a pen grip, but I put it on, it's actually on this pen. It came with the blue pen grip and then it came with the wax. And this one came with the pink tray. And I actually have never had a pink Mosfa boat, so I thought this was really cool. So that was the toolkit for that. And so let's get into it. So it is a 30 by 30. And the thing about Crystal Canvas Art Designs, their canvases are all rhinestone. So first, we're gonna pull out the drills. I'm gonna roll it the opposite way because it is poured glue. And when you have a poured glue canvas, rolling it the opposite way will help it to lay flat without damaging your canvas. Now, this particular canvas, it is a little stiff, but I don't mind that a stiff canvas does not bother me. Um, sometimes when they're stiffer, they don't lay as flat from rolling it backwards, but it's okay, they kind of flatten out on their own. Oh, this one did pretty good. Look at that, guys. Isn't she just a cutie? First of all, she has this wreath around her that has flowers at the top and flowers at the bottom. And then look at it. She's got the purple with the little pink stripe in it. This is pink. It's like a turquoise bluish color. But it's alternating colors going down into the flowers. Isn't that really cute? And then it comes with 24 colors. It has the schematics only on our right side over here. You get two diamonds down at the bottom and then their slogan that glimmers, shimmers, and shines. And then at the very top, you have their brand, the Crystal Canvas Art Designs, a paint by numbers concept, and this is their website. So yes, this was my first one. It's called Dreaming Unicorns. So with this one, what I'm going to do is I'm gonna open up the drills just to kind of give you an idea of what's on here. You'll probably see a big bag of the like diamond or, or crystal looking rhinestones because I believe this all these U's are all that. So you know what we do? I'm going to sing. Why am I going to sing? Because some people can't stand the sound of the plastic when you open it. So here we go. We're opening up the drill. We're opening up the drill. We're opening up, we're opening up, we're opening up the drills. There we go, guys. That wasn't too bad. So, guys, this is funny to me. Let me tell you why. I'm waiting for the day my husband comes in the room and he's going to be like, what the heck are you doing? Because I sing randomly and I love to sing loud just to get on his nerves. He'll be like, close the door. And I'm all, no. So, 
yeah i'm pretty sure one day when i'm doing a video you'll hear him come in and start fussing at me because that's just what he does so let's take a look at some of these colors here so we have some pink purple reds and yellows uh, some greens get some blacks in there some light greens we have some more purples and pink colors yellows golds nice turquoise blue some more light purples and then remember i said there's going to be a big bag of these so these are all the white right here all of these use that's what this big bag is for number 24 and then if we just look at the rest here we got some more um pinks look like that's a grayish color pinks greens and the yellow and then the big bag for the whole outside i'll be excited to see how many crystals i have left after i do these diamond paintings because you know, generally, a lot of, sorry, a lot of companies will say that they'll include like up to 30% more. But yeah, I'll be excited to see how many are left and how I can incorporate them into other paintings. So, again, that was Dreamy Unicorn. And what I'll do is I'll make sure to link the information down in the bottom. Um, I'll put a link on there so that you can just click it and go right to it if this is one you'd like to purchase. And for now, these actually ship free to the U.S. Okay, so Glam Girl, it is a 40 by 55 centimeter. So the story behind this one is, I've told you all I have six siblings. I'm the youngest of seven. I'm lucky number seven. And I have a sister that wants to open up a hair store and this looks like her logo that she wanted to use so i sent it to her and she's like where'd you get that from and i sent it to her so that she could see it i think she said like the hair is just a little bit different but either way it's this girl and i was like oh so i'm thinking about once this is done i don't know if i'm going to keep it and put it on my wall or if i'm going to give it to her because she's very particular with what she does and doesn't like but I've been dealing with her my whole life, so I know what she does and doesn't like. So I'm going to roll this back the opposite way. So this is a stiff canvas, but again, like I said, I don't mind a stiff canvas. Okay. Let's see if we can straighten it out to look at the glam girl. Let's see. I'm just moving the camera back a little bit. So look at this. Okay, so I like this because first off, you have three colors. How about that? Three colors. The red's in her lips, the black is her hair, and everything else is white. Well, the black is the outline of everything, her eyes, her ear, her neck, her shoulder. But look at that. So you get your picture with your schematic. You get their logo with the website. You get another picture with the schematic. You get the two diamonds at the bottom. And then their slogan, Glimmer, Shimmers, and Shines. Oh, guys, I'm trying to straighten it out a little more. Okay, so, isn't she beautiful? Look at that, the way her hair just swings to the side. Those beautiful, luscious red lips. I say that because when I put on my little red lipstick, I get some big, beautiful lips like this. And then look at her hair comes down. You see her neck and her shoulder. So yeah, this one's going to be really cute. And so let's look at the three colors. So what are we going to do? We're going to sing. Why? Because of the crinkle. And so what I forgot to say earlier is I'm going to do one of two things. I'm going to distract you. I'm going to annoy you. Um, or I'm going to distract you, annoy you, and you'll hear the crinkle, which is a win-win-win for me. So, here we go. I'm opening up the drill. I'm opening up the drill. I'm opening up, opening up. I got the drills open. Yeah. Okay, so once again, this whole white background, number one, these bags of crystals. That's the whole background. And then enough for the little bitty lips, the pretty red. And then 
all the black for the black you see in there. That's her outline. And the three colors. Bam, wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. Just like that. So let's get these back in here. And so now that we have these done, I want to talk to you guys about my event. I'm doing an event um, in the month of September. It is called you, hashtag you matter, but the title is your mental health matters. It is a mental health event. Um, mental health a month is mental health a month. <laughs> mental health month is technically in the month of May, but there are two other events going on and um, I didn't want it to be overload. I, I feel like mental health is something that we should do monthly. It shouldn't just be awareness for just one month. You know, it's something that people struggle with every day, every month, every hour, every minute. It is. Now, I don't want to say struggle. I want to say deal because you deal with it. So um, it's going to be from September 1st to September 30th of this year. Um, any diamond painting that makes you feel mentally happy and mentally healthy qualifies you. Um, we'll have a Google form for entry. Um, I'm debating for exit also, but definitely for entry. I have at least 10 confirmed sponsors and I'm going to do three give <laughs> I'm going to do three giveaways with one grand prize, but there will be more details to come. So, um, what do we say? We say, if you like my videos, we're going to give me a thumbs up. Two, if you got them. <laughs> Guys, I'm in such a goofy mood today. Um, if you like my videos, consider hitting that subscribe button. And then remember, you are worthy. You are loved. You are beautiful. And if no one's told you that they love you today, I love you. And I'm sending you a heart.